talked about the world of chatbots, so kind of your 2023 real-time predictive response. Last year, we bring reasoning to the table. So now a model that thinks for longer and can do long horizon tasks that you would send an analyst out to do. 2025 is the year of agents. We started talking about it probably Q3 of Q4 last year. It's now become the term the industry is using. But this is AI that can go out and do work independently for you. And this is not vaporware. We're not selling ahead. We actually have three things working today. Deep research, which is the agentic tool to go do a real deep research report for you. Operator, which is what we've launched to allow a task worker to go out on the web and do something for you that might take time in the background. Book a flight, book a holiday, book dinner tonight, whatever you want to do. And then the third that is coming is what we call a suite. We are not the best marketers, by the way, you might have noticed, <laughs> uh, but agentic software engineer. And this is not just augmenting the current software engineers in your workforce, which is kind of what we can do today through Copilot, but instead it's literally an agentic software engineer that can build an app for you. It can take a PR that you would give to any other engineer and go build it. But not only does it build it, it does all the things that software engineers hate to do. It does its own QA, its own quality assurance, its own bug testing and bug bashing, and it does documentation, things you can never get software engineers to do. So suddenly you can force multiply your software engineering workforce. From there, we think we're moving into this world of innovation where it's no longer about the human knowledge that exists in the world today. It's about how to extend that. And we're actually hearing that from professors and academics, that they're finding the models are coming up with novel things in their field. They don't yet know if those novel things are real because they now need to go <laughs> and test and say, is that actually a new discovery? But we, we are actually hearing that back from academia and then longer term agentic organizations. 